he's got his single seat apart. Oh. Oh. Happy New Year everyone, 1st of January 2020 and welcome to the Bloody Ants and Motor Show's new YouTube channel, or the BAMs for short, we're just going to call it the BAMs all the time, so if ever you want to know what it stands for, you've got to come back to this first video to find out, it'll be written across the top of the, of the channel anyway. Got loads of filming to do, sent 2019 off last night with a bit of a blast. <laughs> Shop with the Jedi, um, a couple of friends around, and yeah, first of January, 2020. There's no better time, really, is there, to start? Let's do this. It's gonna be a good year. It's gonna be a good year. Good year. The coronavirus has hit the UK. Full national lockdown. Coronavirus. Coronavirus. Virus. The virus. Virus. Coronavirus. Virus. A coronavirus. It's invisible killer. You must stay at home. What the fuck was that? I don't think anyone was expecting that. Um, yeah, what a year. And we haven't actually got anything done at all. Apart from general work, but nothing filming wise. It's just been dead. Not allowed to go anywhere, not allowed to do anything. So COVID-19 has totally messed our year up. Wanted to again, like I say, get the channel started right the way back at the beginning of the year. Just got really busy, didn't end up doing it. And obviously with the lockdown and everything, I actually got busier in lockdown, which is, I suppose, rare. Um, but I was lucky anyway, so appreciate that. Here we are, we might as well start now. Oh, just got a visitor. Hello, cat. We've got a new mascot. Oh, hello. Anyway, welcome to the HEM headquarters. This is where I do all me bits and pieces and work. Anyone that knows us, knows this place, anyone that doesn't, this is it. Got an office down there. Got a rat catcher over there. Benches, cars, loft, container, all that sort of stuff. You'll see it all anyway as we go along. So, if you've come here from the Facebook page, then you'll know who I am. He's probably on my Facebook anyway. Um, if not, then you wouldn't have seen it. I'm Steve from Steve Hatton from the H and HM. Um, myself, I've been racing now for 10 years, must be 10 years or more, hill climbing. Sprinting. And doing a bit of drifting. And a bit of auto solo. So we're gonna, do, we're gonna mix it up a little bit. My dad, Bob Hatton, if you know him or if you don't, He's been doing the same. So he was sort of sprinting and hill climbing and bits and pieces since before I was born um, in his Camaro and then doing a lot of nitrous and a lot of things and being in magazines back in the 70s, 80s. Um, so yeah, that's my background really. The fact that we've just been in and around motorsport for a long, long time. There's gonna be a lot of cool stuff that we're gonna be getting on with. Um, building cars, racing cars, crashing cars, all that kind of thing. Hopefully not the crashing. Up, but we're going to be doing some I wouldn't mind building a drag car I've never built a drag car never built a full-blown drift car even think of maybe an MR2 drift car because they're unusual people don't use them they're horrible to drive to try and drift you can't get much angle so we'll see what we can do with that um, we're going to be building projects we're going to be building fun stuff I want to make some quick go-karts with different engines and bits and pieces on there I want to make some trikes we want to just sort of play around with things and, and see where we go with that um, we've got the expertise to be able to do it, we've got the tools to do it, we've got the knowledge to do it, we've got the engines and the know-how and the bits and pieces that we need, so we just as well put it together and try and chuck some good content out there for you guys. We'll see how it goes. As I say, we are the Bloody Ants and Moat Show. We started from, well we started 
doing bits and pieces for the Facebook page way back in 2018, I think it was. And we had a day um, out at Perranporth, which was supposed to be like an experience day in one of the cars, sort of like a local kit car company. And it didn't go to plan, it wasn't very busy, no one was there. So we were like, right, we'll just start filming and doing some like promo stuff for the cars. So we were whipping around and we we're like, actually, this could be pretty good. We do a lot of this stuff anyway. We've got all the facilities and things to do some cool stuff, so we'll just start doing it. Filmed loads and loads and loads and loads of footage, and then it just went dead. Nothing happened. The footage just sat on someone's hard drive. Nothing got done with it. So two years later, here we are. I'm gonna do it all by myself, because why not? It's a bit of a waste not doing anything with it, not doing anything with the facilities we've got here. What we're able to do, things we've built, cars we've raced, stuff we've done, so that's where we're gonna start with. What I want to do with the channel, um, not just the going out, doing the motorsport stuff, having these big videos, we're just going to do lots of like short videos as well, project cars. We've got projects on the go, like the MR2 here, which is having my old race engine out of the black MR2. We've got this one, which is coming in for a full resto as well, the Torino. So we've got a lot of cool cars, a lot of cool projects, a lot of cool stuff going on, engines being built, cars being raced, and anything motorsport related, really, as much as we can. Not sure what I'm going to add on to the end of this um, for the like kind of intro to the channel, I suppose. Maybe just chuck some footage on of some old racing or something like that. But I've got all the other stuff that we've filmed stacked up, ready to go. So we're going to move on with that. Um, yeah, like, comment, subscribe, do whatever you do with the normal channels, and try and get it out there as much as we can. And see where we go. I'm not totally sure on the direction yet of what we're going to end up with. But we're going to end up with something, we're going to film it, and it's going to be alright, I think it'll be pretty cool.